Hey, what's up you guys? This is Haley here and uh, Ethan actually wanted me to do this video so I'm just gonna let him jump on in here real fast but this is my boyfriend does my makeup tutorial voiceover. I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay, well hello. Oh, make her pucker face. Okay, if, oh, the first step is take off our glasses, obviously, because we're gonna put on our makeup. Oh, and then get our contacts in because we still need to see because we wear glasses and there's baby Franklin and we're gonna wash her face now with whatever was on the previous screen and flip our put our hair in a ponytail because it's gonna be in our way if you have long hair and put whatever that thing is and then you have some kind of thing what is that thing? Oh, you put it on your face. That's some clear gel thing that's... I don't know what it does, It, it, it but it helps. I've, I've read good things about it. Bought it from Japan. Oh, and then we're going to use this what fit thing, which is a something poreless pipe foundation? Yeah, on top of this foam bubble. We poured way too much. Okay, so then we, we dab, dab, dab. Dab. It's 2017, everybody, so we must dab. And then we, we just quickly, good lord, put that all over our face as fast as humanly possible. And uh, make sure you don't spend too much time on this. And we, we cover our face where we no longer look like ourselves. And then we do something to make us look younger with this age renewal. And we uh, use that for under our eyes because they look old all the time. They get lots of wrinkles, lots of wrinkles on the eyes, and oh, we, we uh, dabbed that real fast, what we did with our little egg foam thing, and then we, uh, we keep dabbing really fast, once again 2017, we're dabbing all the time, and then we use our tiny baby purple egg to, to add some more underneath the eyes and we're looking good at this point and we're looking good we we, we then use a powder it's called a loose face powder and, and oh and, and then and then we use a blush palette uh, which has all those colors in it and we like those two colors a lot yes those are our two favorites and oh we use those to uh, to highlight our cheeks because our cheeks look fleek and uh, do people still use fleek? Yeah, I don't know. And then, uh, yep, so they look pink now. They weren't really pink before, so we want to make them pink and get our hair cotton fit. And then uh, then we're going to use this, uh, uh, oh, the two browner colors. I'll mix that into our pink for our cheeks so it looks good. And then we fling, just fling all that powder that you had on your brush off of your face because you, you don't need that now. It's gone. And then we use, now we finally use this thing, which has, is really dusty. We haven't used it in a long time, and we're going to use that. That's, we're going to dip it in, and our brush. And then, oh, we're going to dab that real fast. Here we go. Dab, 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 dab. Put it all over your face. Make sure it's all, all up in your face, even on the stuff that you just did. And then use so much that you have to cough. And then, uh, perfect. Yeah, we've used enough. And uh, now we're going to use something for our eye. Yeah, it's gonna go right on top of our eye to uh, make that look uh, more natural. And then, uh, oh, we use something that looks, oh, okay, well, it's uh, got a little mirror in it and it's got th only three colors that look, you know, pretty similar. And then we, we put that uh, on our eyebrows to make them darker because they're, they're light and they need color. And then we uh, decorate those up. But those look good now. Okay, we're done with that. All done with that. They look fresh. And then we we like this color. It's a it's called chocolate bar. It's a chocolate bar one. And then it's, uh, we put that back on top of other stuff we've already done uh, to hide the stuff we've put on. And then uh, we we mix that all together and dab that on. And then we use uh, another brush uh, that we we like. We use the same from the same palette. We use a darker brown to go above our eyes to go on top of the other stuff we put on to hide all that other stuff. And we mix those together on top of our eyes. 
And now we're starting to, uh, we're getting the hang of it. And there we go. Oh, well, we maybe. Oh, and then we go back to the color, and we, we put that on top of the stuff we just put on, because never get enough. We kind of make sure, and it's it's looking pretty good. Like like the eyes. Uh, yep, that looks great. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then uh, we use the one right underneath it, which is like a weird white pink, and that goes in the corner to accentuate your corner eyeball. And then uh, now we're gonna use some eyeliner. Put that on our eyes. This is the scary part. Um, for OCD people, this is uh, a difficult process. And uh, now we're gonna create some wings, like we're little bats. <laughs> we're gonna get that good and stab our eyes. And then, oh, we're gonna use a pencil now, and we're gonna poke that right in our, maybe, right in our eyes, yep, and just draw on our eyelids. That's what you're gonna wanna do. Uh, just really rip those babies apart and uh, tear those things up because who needs eyes yeah so it's looking good now we're, we're looking okay and uh, now we're gonna do something with the case something's in the case and we've got some uh, eyelashes we're gonna put on and they got some uh, we'll put some uh, adhesive on it and blow on that make sure it's nice and dried up the adhesive to uh, stick to your eyeball. Yep, and here we go. Oh, maybe not. Here we go. Make sure to watch carefully as you do this with one eye, your other eye, the eye you're not putting it on. As you quick, you gently place the adhesive uh, eyelash on, and now we're now our eyes are looking good. And I think we're almost done here. We're gonna, oh, we're gonna add some, uh, I think that's mascara, is that what that's called? And oh, yep, that's what, I think so. And uh, we're gonna use our, we're gonna just blend our real eyelashes and our fake eyelashes together, make them seem seamless. Now we're gonna do our lips that need to be cut. We're gonna use a pencil for this though, not the uh, typical liquid or lipstick, I guess. This is a, a pencil I like to use, a color, coloring books with it it's real nice and uh, oh we're just we're outlining our lips so we know where to go and then we're gonna use I know what this is this is Kylie yep this is a very expensive product uh, I spent way too much money on it and uh, then I'm gonna put this on my lips and, uh, and uh, it looks real good it looks real nice red deep color and then I gotta smack my lips together make sure it's sticking to my lip and not gonna attract to my teeth and now we're looking good we're looking good and now we're gonna use some uh, something that sprays it says uh, yeah what's that say it's something spray and when it's kind of like a hairspray it just makes your makeup stay there in case it falls off your face or something and then uh, yeah we're looking it's looking good I'll make sure to wave that and air dry that out sit in front of a fan if you need to well I think that's it I think we're done we're looking good and go out and start our day and uh, you know Thanks for watching and uh, be sure to subscribe and uh, she sometimes put out videos. She's very inconsistent but she's working on it and uh, she does stuff like this once in a while. Her hair's looking good. Yep. Yep. She just got it redone so it looks really nice. Yeah. Her makeup looks good and Bruce is bugging me. Oh and okay. Bye. Bye. Here we go.